The Qinyang yam sauce has a history over 100 years. Miss Li Su Qing is the sixth generation of inheritors. Chinese yam must be fried before making sauce. When the oil temperature reaches 200 degrees, add pepper and star anise first, and then add more than a dozen precious spices, such as grass cardamom, fructo amomi, baiko, galangal, etc. Boil with high heat, stew with low fire, and seal the jar after an hour. Time itself will neutralize all kinds of flavors to the best, leaving a mellow fragrance. Ma, my brother came back. Ah, I came back. Ah. Li Suqing opened the jar that had been sealed for more than half a year. It was a large piece of beef yam sauce, specially prepared for her son. A beef yam sauce not only retains the fragrance of the sauce, but also adds the juicy taste of the meat. Yam sauce can be mixed with most ingredients. The steamed bass is covered with a layer of yam sauce, sprinkled with shallots, and drenched with a spoonful of hot oil to make it fresh and tender with a strong fragrance. Mother prepared the meal for more than half a year. The thick yam sauce and sweet yam cake are full of the flavor of hometown and the mother's love.